Here I am at the local uh, limestone quarry. Stone here is blasted, mostly turned into crust stone for road building and concrete. They do allow me to take the larger pieces, but I need to load them myself using the uh, crane on my truck, so I'm a bit limited to the uh, size of stone I can get. Here I am weighing up the boulder. Came in at 1,455 kilograms, or 3,207 pounds. So I'll try to quickly go over here how I do the design in Inkscape. First thing I do is take a picture of the stone with a tape measure. Then I import that picture into Inkscape. Draw a line with a known length, in case this red line here. If I scroll in. I've drawn this with a length of 24 inches and I place the uh, line along the tape measure to see what the uh, length is shown in the picture. So if we scroll in here we can see it's approximately 29 and a half inches. So to get the scale that I need to apply to the picture, I take that uh, 29 and a half and I divide it by 24 the known length and we end up with a scale of 1.23 and so if we go back over to here we see that the uh, current width of the picture is 73.5 and we make sure we lock on the aspect ratio lock and so we're going to take this number and multiply it by 1.23 so times 73.5 equals 90.34 so we'll put 90.34 in here and if we move that line back along the tape measure we should see that it is now 24 inches long And there it is, 24 inches long. So now this image is scaled to real size. And any designs I draw on here, I can be sure that it will actually fit on the stone. And I'll show you that in a minute here. So after I have the picture scaled in Inkscape, I just do a outline of the uh, stone using the line tool. So I select the, have the line tool selected here and I just start drawing straight lines to approximate the outline of the stone. That way when I'm doing a design I can I just make sure I can stay within the within the outline. So I've already done that here. I'll just show you the uh, finished outline. So now that I have this outline I can turn off the, uh, the picture and do my design and just make sure I stay within this area. So here's the finished design that I came up with for this particular stone.
the oh, Craig's got a new video. So glad I subscribed.